Hey, it's Eric. I just got done doing a video on how to calculate miles per gallon and uh, your price that you're making per mile. Um, so, and then when I was doing that, I, f I had real numbers involved, which are right here. And I figured, what the hey, I might as well do one on uh, an owner operator running his own authority hauling cars, uh, just because I'm sure people would want to know what what kind of money you can make doing it so here we go um i just want to do a a, a a a big time clause because these numbers are not very exciting at all and i get that and i i am an independent guy and this isn't my main source of income and i work hard enough to not have to work in the winter time. So in the winter time, I haul cars because my main um, source of income slows down, but I feel like I need to keep money coming in year round. So one of the things that I have uh, a niche, a trucking niche that I found is hauling cars. So I haul cars for a broker, a broker, and I work, you know, seven to eight hours a day, like from turning my, start my truck to shut my truck off. And I work three to five days a week, you know, more, if it's snowing out, I don't go, I don't work. Uh, if I stay up too late watching Netflix, I don't work. Um, it worked, the, the, the car hauling industry works really well with, me just not really giving a crap about um, needing to get up and 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 really making a living every you know every day. It's it's more of a lifestyle thing for me where I can continue to pay my bills and I can catch up on a lot of the stuff that I missed all summer long. So, with that being said, here's some numbers, and I'll. Uh, Put some pictures of my setup on there so that you can see kind of what you know what is the investment that I have with what I have going on so I have a four car I have a four car setup it I have a regular tractor trailer that I use for other jobs that I do and then I just bought a a four car um, they call them four pack to haul stuff in the winter time so I put on 747 miles this week, not the week that I'm talking about, but this in this example. So everything is a week's time period. 747 miles. I've used 110 gallons of fuel, which at last winter was $281.28, which equaled that, which meant that I was paying $255 per gallon. Fuel is quite a bit more now. So the numbers would be different. So then um, what you do is to figure out your miles per So your miles per gallon are 747 divided by 110, which is your weeks, um, your total, your gross amount of, your weeks amount of miles for that week, and then your that's how much fuel it is. And it, that's so, it's just something that I want to know. I'm getting six miles almost seven miles per gallon um, and then six let's see here six point seven nine times how much it costs per gallon wait a second that's not right is it 255 yeah it is okay so 255 Per gallon, it's 281 bucks. So my operating expenses for the week in just for my fuel costs, not including my really expensive insurance for hauling cars, is $281.28 just for fuel. Okay, and then after I paid my 20% to the broker, I made two hundred or two thousand seventy-four dollars and seventy-eight cents, 
you take out the let's see so then I so I made 277 per mile per round trip mile and then after you take out the 20% for my brokerage fee and for fuel I made $1,793 as an owner operator. Um, not nothing crazy to write home about. I realize that, but that's just what that's just what I did. And if you were really trying to get aggressive with it and and really get ahead with this, you know, these numbers could be different. But this is just real life. This is what I did, working you know eight seven hours a day, three to three to four days a week. I don't know what, I can't remember how many days I worked this week. But if you think about it, after fuel, you know, if I worked just a little bit harder and I could make $2,000 a week, I mean, that's not super bad. I mean, and you're home every night. So, yeah, I'd love to hear your, your feedback and comments and ideas and or questions or telling me that I suck as a person or that you love me as a person yeah just let me know